Hey guys, it's Andrew here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to add a Tinker tool to your Mac. And what this does, it enables some hidden settings in apps, or it could just change the overall feel of your Mac in general. So to get started, you're going to want to download the Tinker tool DMG file that's linked in the description below. After you open that up, just accept the terms, and then drag and drop Tinker tool into your Applications folder. Alright, now after you move to your tool to your Applications folder, open it up, and you can see from your main menu, you could change it on some finder options, like showing and hiding the system files. From your dock menu, you could stop apps from leaving the dock. You could also disable some animations when showing or hiding apps from your dock, and even making the icons of hidden apps transparent as well. Under general, you're going to have basic all-around um, system changes, like how your power button reacts when you tap it, how your screenshots are formatted and how they are saved, and then also changing how your windows animate when they're opened. Under desktop, you're not going to have many useful features. The only one that you could really use is showing the image file path on it from the wallpaper. You can see here that it shows exactly where that wallpaper image is stored. Under applications, these are just for Apple utilities. These are enabling debug menus. Um, fonts, you could change the actual font in your system. Just know that you would have to actually install the font um, using the font utility that's where it comes with your Mac before you actually could change the system font. Under Safari, iTunes, and QuickTime, it's pretty much just playback controls and showing and hiding title bars whenever you're playing a movie or a music file. Now if you ever notice any lag on your Mac or you just want to go back to your default settings, go to the reset menu in Tinker Tool and then just tap reset defaults and you'll be all back to the stock settings that came with your Mac. Alright guys, this is going to do it for Tinker Tool. Be sure to check out the full guide that linked in the description below and like always be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Have a good one guys.